I am a caffeine addict. And today I will be trying to drink a hundred mugs of coffee. Mug? I'm going to drink a hundred of these, which is equivalent of five of these. <laughs> calculated how much caffeine it will take to kill me. Apparently it's 230 mugs of coffee, so I should be fine. But on the other hand, I'm expecting dizziness, headaches, hysteria. Um, I'm basically expecting to overdose on caffeine. So I guess we'll see what happens. Amazon stuff is. Uh -huh. I reckon I can get three mugs out of this. So how many of these do I need to make? Um, thirty. Three. And a third. <laughs> right. Okay. You will actually have a hundred and two cups of coffee. That's the first cup. And so it begins. Cup number one. Cheers. That was quite hot. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Ooh. I suspect this is going to be very dull for the first 50 cups. <laughs> yeah. Perhaps. This is why I brought it's a guitar. It's going to be yeah. a normal day for drinking coffee. coffee for me. Yes. I do, I, if I want to do this in 10 hours, I have to drink one cup of coffee every 6 minutes. Are you, <laughs> are you going to do it over a longer period of time? Yes. Well, the thing is, is I'm just going to drink them as quickly as I feel like I can. Yeah. And to be honest, by the end of the 10 hours, it probably won't matter. No. Because I'll be awake. Yes. Yeah. Oh yes, yes. You will. <laughs> For the next month. I really hope not. Uh, I I learned from my crazy, in, insane, druggy drumming friend mm. that if you eat too many uh, like pet pills, you get really sleepy. So maybe if you drink too much coffee, you get really mm. sleepy. Maybe you'll pass through wakefulness. And yeah. To sleepiness. <laughs> Indeed. It will be slightly surreal. Yeah. If you fall asleep at Cup 75, we're going to poke you with sticks. I talked to um, someone who's drunk 80 cups of tea, and they said at Cup 83, they went and threw up. But because all they'd been drinking all day was hot tea, they just threw up sort of a warm stream of liquid, which is apparently quite pleasant. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm having to imagine something similar. <laughs> Excellent. His last sip. Yeah. That was my first cup of coffee. How do you feel? Like I've just had a cup of coffee. That's fair. I think I'm going to have cup two. Ah. <coughs> On to cup two. Is that enough coffee, you think? Any shots? Well, this is coffee number five. I've been going an hour, and I've had four coffees, and I already feel ill. Um, I'm not sure I understand this really, on the grounds that I drink regularly this much caffeine in this period of time, I'm fine. Um, I think it's possibly the mental thing that's going with it. Um, oh, I'm doing that a lot as well. Um, <laughs> but I, I'm determined to keep going, so this is coffee five. Motor control's gone. <laughs> <laughs> so you've just had your tenth cup of coffee? This is the last just now. And how are you feeling? Uh, not great. <laughs> um, I think I've just had so much liquid in me now that I'm on the verge of uh, of, of of having coffees backwards. Um, <laughs> Well, at some point, you probably should have coffees backwards. Otherwise, you may grow large. I'm hoping not to have the mic, though. Um, ah, yes. 
coffees downwards then? I um <laughs> I'm having trouble thinking or following sentences. Uh, I feel really tired, which I wasn't expecting. Um, yeah, so I feel sick, but probably from the liquid. I feel tired, slightly nauseous, and like my brain has been filled with concrete. Oh. That's ten cups. And ten cups. Only ninety more to go. <laughs> Don't say things like that. <laughs> God. Okay. Yes. I'll see you in another ten cups. Indeed. Get Richard to look up on the on the web how much caffeine in each mug. This. Um. I think you should actually just go to the caffeine database. Um, instant. Coffee Instant has 7.13. So, oh. So it's about. Twice. Double. So you take it. <laughs> Lovely. It's like the vomit of emperors. Okay, well after consulting uh, a caffeine chart on the caffeine content of various coffees, it's become clear that I was calculating my death total of about 230 coffees on cups of instant coffee, which contain about half as much caffeine as what I've been drinking. Which probably would explain why I'm feeling so ill so early on. Um, <laughs> um, on this ground, I'm going to count every cup of coffee I have as two. Um, oh, and probably stop at 50. Because my estimations therefore mean I'll die about 115 cups. I'm not so keen on that. So I'll get back to you in another couple of cups time. I'm not making weak coffee by any stretch of the imagination. No, 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 no. The pit of doom of coffee. <laughs> this is the contaminants of what I've been drinking. Nice. I'm just going to empty out the most of the liquid and see what we get left with. Oh, that's not too bad actually. Sort of grainy. Slightly liquid. Okay, well I've now had 16 cups of coffee and I now have caffeine headache. Um, I'm burping a lot. I suspect that's probably from the amount of liquid rather than anything else. Um, I'm not that shaky. Uh, I don't actually feel that bad apart from a slight headache. Um, I seem to have got more control now than I did at 10. Um, so yeah, I think it's going pretty well. Oh. Ah, is that good coffee? It's good coffee. Right. Um, two hours, 45 minutes. About six cups of coffee now. About six cups of coffee now. So a cup, a cup of coffee every ten minutes is what I've been drinking. Oh. What are we playing here? We're playing Munchkin, which is an incredibly silly but kindly entertaining game. Right, yes. who's going there anyway? It's not the dice is going. Right. Eighteen coffees. Eighteen, Ed. Eighteen. Right, I'm going to pull a loop. <laughs> 20 cups at 14.50. You've junk, just drunken 20 cups of coffee. How are you feeling? Like death. <laughs> I feel like I'm about to throw up all the time. Um, I've got a headache. The light's too bright. Um, I, I, I've got pains running up my arms. 
Um, <laughs> uh, I occasionally twitch. And he keeps okay. doing yes. that a lot. Yes. <laughs> I'm good. <He> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. I'm not looking forward to 60 cups. <laughs> <laughs> or 80. <laughs> But 90 you'll probably look forward to. A 90 would be great, <laughs> yeah. Um, and then 99 when... The suddenly, idea of actually of getting coffee. to 100 a day is so awful, I can't even imagine it. <sighs> oh, God. I've got another 80 cups to go. This is true. I've been doing this for how long now? Three hours. Three hours, minutes. and I have 80 more cups to go. So on that grounds, I have another, like... 12 hours of the... Yeah, yeah. Edwin is currently drinking coffee at one cup every nine minutes and 15 seconds. Oh. I'm not greatly happy. But it's for science. It is. And stupidity. Don't forget stupidity. And it's it also for stupidity. Cup 21, people. Here it goes. Cheers. <laughs> it's itchy. What was that? My hair is itchy. Edwin has only had 22 <laughs> cups of coffee at this point. <laughs> oh. Your actual hair is itchy. My actual hair is... <laughs> but, oh. but not your scalp. No, my hair. Is, is that relieving your itch? Or oh, scratchy it. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to survive, am I? What are you up to? Would 22? You... <laughs> Would you like to make your last will and testament now on film? Yes, yes. In the case of my death, I would like everyone to have an enormous party and drink a hundred cups of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> and thus join me in the afterlife. Yay. Here's to 23. All of my stuff goes to Nick Gunsberg. <laughs> I didn't say that. Apart from the books, which go to Richard. <laughs> oh, okay, that's fair. Oh, oh, that's horrible coffee. <laughs> Edwin is on a new batch. Yes. Is this batch less good than the other batch? Yeah. And it has a side effects of making your hair itchy. <laughs> Apparently so. <laughs> <laughs> What brand coffee was this so we can yell at them later? It was like, I don't know, some... Me it was Mexican. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. It was Mexican coffee. <laughs> Blame the Mexicans. Is it my go? Yes. yes. Thank God for that. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Edwin has lost fine memory. What if... What? <laughs> <laughs> Cowboy walk. Mine's side to your next combat. There was a slight miscalculation with the coffee. <laughs> Again. Again. Because of the strength of the coffee I've been drinking, we've calculated that I've now, in effect, drunk 35 cups of coffee. <laughs> I have the shakes. My hair itches. My teeth ache. I'm having muscle twinges. I can barely walk. I feel sick all the time. Um, I occasionally twitch with my eyes. Uh, I'm, I'm, I, everything seems slightly speeded up. Like, everything around me is moving a bit sort of quicker than normal, or slower, one or the other, I can't really tell. And I think, um, and I can't think properly. So, I'm going to see how far I go with this, but I, I'm, I'm going to the point where I think I might actually be Doing permanent damage. Um, I, I'm, I'm getting the impression that people shouldn't drink this much caffeine. Ooh. Or this much coffee. Uh, yeah, so... I, this might be it. I don't know. We'll see. Ah, oh, my arm hurts now. Edwin. <laughs> Edwin is currently drinking coffee at a rate of one cup every six and a half minutes. Ah. Oh. You know this when you're magical. He also it. can't hold the coffee <laughs> to drink it. <laughs> this may be a problem 
in getting him to drink more coffee. We can give him a straw, it's okay. <laughs> oh. One, one member can speak in um, How are you feeling, Edmund? <laughs> Not great. <laughs> I have no... Mm. Really? <laughs> oh, I, feel, I feel like I'm really drunk. Hmm. You, you do actually appear to be acting quite as if you were drunk. Oh, uh, yeah. I do feel really kind of... I don't know. Like I, I can't really think properly, and my brain's shut down. And like I'm really drunk. I haven't drunk anything. I just had lots of coffee. Not sure this is a good thing. No. no. I think maybe thirty-seven cups is where I need to stop. <laughs> In retrospect, and what's the time? It has now been four hours. 37 cups in four hours. That's a lot of coffee. Yes. I'm beginning to be worried that I might actually die from the water, if nothing else. Because that much water will kill you. Um, 100 cups of water would kill you quite easily in a day. You have to look out for that dihydrogen monoxide. Who we wear one? <laughs> dihydrogen monoxide poisoning. I see. But... Yeah, so I'm, how many cups a minute? Or six and a half minutes a cup still. That's quite a lot really, isn't it? Yes, you're about a third there, aren't you? Yeah. 37? So I'm yeah, more than a third there, there, but I'm not going to make it to 100. It's just not physically possible. You would die. Um, I would die. I suspect the reason no one has tried to do this before is because it's a bad plan. A, it's not very sensible, and B, it's not actually possible. <laughs> um, I think 37 is a very reasonable number for four hours. Yeah. Well... Personally. If you drink 37 today, and 38 tomorrow, and you can work your way up... <laughs> no. No. <laughs> No, no. I, I uh, yeah. I think this might be it. I think I might not drink anymore. My eyesight's what? going. Uh -huh. All the colours are very slightly like brown. Coffee seeps into his eyeballs. <laughs> <laughs> it is like it's like I'm viewing the world in sepia. <coughs> it's a bit mm. strange. And sort of. I have a function on here for sepia. Really? Yes. I think 37. So, I challenge you to beat 37. <coughs> and then sneeze. If you can beat 37, I'll be very impressed. Is that your challenge to the world? To the world. To YouTube. It's my challenge to YouTube. 37 cups of coffee in 4 hours and 5 minutes. If you do better and don't die, I will salute you. Yay. Try not to die. Whereas if you I die, die you'll get a di Darwin Award. You will get a Darwin Award. It's true. Yeah. See if you can not feel your fingers either. <laughs> and and see if your hair is itchy. My hair is so itchy. It's not right. <laughs> Coffee has given Ed extrasensory perception in his hair. It's true. <laughs> More studies will have to be done. Good luck. Dun-da-da-dun. Dun, dun, dun.